Live from Jerome Harden Studios. This is the latest of my newscast I'm willing to tell you about. So as you sit back, relax, chillax, and I'll tell you later stuff. What's up? I'm JR. You're chilling, all right? Let's get started. Um, yeah, the reason I'm making this uh, video right now is because of the recent snow we had. And now, outside, today is Saturday, February 15th, which is after Valentine's Day of 2014. But, um, yeah... It's kind of like cold outside right now, but tomorrow is supposed to go up into the next weekend because it's supposed to be up in the 70s by uh, next weekend. So, um, yeah, I'm pretty excited about that because um, this week has been cold. We had snow, and now the remaining snow is on the bridges and overpasses and highways and stuff, which uh, the snow clouds have been plowing over the snow. These past couple of days now they're melting away or turning into water or the remaining water of the snow is a uh, little bit supposed now so that's good news right there and good thing is I recorded and took pictures of the snowy days that we had so beautiful around my house and stuff so I can take you and show you that in a few seconds so just letting you know and when hot and cold combine at this time of year winter Later on in the spring, it could get really ugly. You know that, right? I mean, hot and cold combined, not a good combination. Because, you know, when cold air combined with hot air, I mean, it forms a tornado. So, you might want to be aware of that. Because, you know, spring is uh, spring is uh, notorious for severe weather. So, you might keep, a, might keep on mind on that. Keep in mind on that. I'm sorry about that. But, anyways. Yeah, um... I'm going to show you what uh, the snow days are looking like around my neighborhood. And, of course, the roads are dangerous. Now they're safe again. So, yeah, I'll take you that. And then I'll end the newscast from there. And remember, when springtime comes and uh, warm air comes around next week, enjoy it while it lasts. Because later on in the springtime, it could get really ugly, okay? Keep in mind on that once again. All right? All right, roll the tape, please. And... We do not, um, hopefully anything does bad does not happen like it did back in 2011 in April 27, where many people died in Alabama and many homes are destroyed. So, yeah, it's a pretty sad day, but we got past that and now hopefully it doesn't happen again. But this time we're rather prepared. Okay. Now, what's let's going on, everyone? This is JDR right here. Um, in Huntsville, Alabama, right now, you see all the snow on the ground. Since uh, we had that big snowstorm and that big snow cover up since um, early winter of 2011, I just wanted to show you that how much snow has fallen since last night. You can see the footprints I made right here. Um, to me, it's not that cold right now, but in the mean later time, it could freeze up to, to like um, 20 degrees, something like that, or get into single digits. So that's what happened right here. Um, yeah, just, uh, look at this car right here, where it cov it was covered in snow, and you can see you can make yourself a snowball right here, you can see this, uh-huh, see how much of it is covered my car and stuff, you can see all that, and you can just make a snowball out of it, so, yeah, and it's, um, the roads are pretty slippery right now, so if, if you are, like, um, if you had to drive like on a snowy or slippery road or something or uh, if unnecessary if you don't have to drive at all it's best for you to stay home do not go joyriding at all please do not because uh, you could ha get yourself in the risk of a wreck which is uh, pretty bad or if you get stuck in a ditch is uh, pretty slippery and icy and stuff um, it's a greater risk that um, you're gonna get stuck there and you have to call a tow truck to get it out and it could be costly like uh fifty five dollars or more so you definitely don't want that okay yeah a nice black in the snow right here you see yeah so all I'm gonna do is just uh stay home since uh the roads are too icy and slippery um and see all the snow on the road as soon as you uh pat it down and it it can turn into ice very quickly, so be careful, okay? All right. Now.
All right, this is round two of snow. This is Thursday, February 13, 2014. You see all the snow right here? Recently snowed last night, and this morning nobody couldn't go out because of the slippery roads and stuff. The roads are iced over. Well, the snow you can see right here, you can't obviously play in the snow because it's been iced over, and you can't even make a snowball. Oh, yes, you can. You can make a snowball, but not that much still. You can make a little bit of it, but whatever. Um, see this pretty per perfect blanket of snow, and you can see the sun coming out. It's pretty clear right now, and uh, this morning, um, it's beautiful outside. I'm going to take a picture of it and put it on Instagram. And you can see these trees, all these uh, branches down and stuff because of the heavy snow we had. Yeah, I like snow, but some people hated it as they told me. But, you know, yeah, I ruined a perfect blanket of snow with my footprints. But it's just too beautiful outside this morning. See, um, you, there, there was a garden right here and you can't even see it because of uh, the blanket of snow. And I don't know if it's just raindrops or it's just the animal who walked through here. So, yeah, see that down tree? Um, it's not supposed to stand up like that, but whatever. It's just a heavy ice in anyway, so, yeah. And there are some spots that uh, snow is melting and uh, snow is uh, stacking on top of the gates and stuff. Ooh, yeah. What a snowstorm last night. But, just as the news people said, uh, just stay off the roads and stay home if you can. Or if you had to go work, I feel sorry for y'all anyway. Yeah. Walking on the ice and stuff, pretty slick. Just like the roads out there. And the bridges and overpasses. Woo! Don't want to get on those because, you know, get putting yourself in the risk of an accident. If you do that, I mean, don't go down. Is that a snowplow right here? Well, then, never mind. Well, this is part two of the snowstorm. Should be over by this afternoon. Most of the snow should melt. Let's go see the front. And so, yeah, pretty much the front is the same. Well, let me just end my newscast from here. But until next time, I'm J Dog. I'm out. Peace.